Hello guys, welcome to Song Town. Still in Kotonou Benin Republic. I'm in a village here. Just want to um, probably get on water. The water you're seeing just down there. I've never been on water before. Hopefully, <laughs> today will be a very interesting one. So let's see how it goes. This is Song Town. In case you're here for the first time, welcome to Song Town. The home of juju music and i hope you subscribe to this channel and you know you're gonna love it because on this channel i upload videos about juju music i, I upload uh sonia de ebeniza obe and and a couple of other juju musicians but most times it's um uh, sonia de and, and uh, ebeniza obe here are some nice artwork some african artwork Let's see how this one is. So I'm gonna go on water later on, but I just want you guys to see some wonderful apps here. At the entrance of the resort center. I think it's a resort center or something like that. So I'm gonna show you guys when I'm on on the water. I'm not <laughs> I'm kind of nervous though because like I said, I've never been on water, so I don't know if it's going to be a canoe or a flying boat or something like that. It's a very cool environment. It's a cool place and I love the area. Some coconut trees here. You can see There's some nice uh, vegetation here. And we have more arts here. Wow, this is a really nice, very nice artwork here. Okay, and down there is a lion. I think, yeah, that's a lion. Okay, so let's get to the next chapter. Here is the entrance to the place. I think it's a, it's a resort center. So I'll be going through here. As you can see, it's a, it's a nice place. It's a nice sitting arrangement. I actually didn't know it's a resort center, but um, I think I... I'll probably have to come back some other time and, you know, just chill out. This is what the place looks like from here.
I, I love the view here. I really like it. And I don't know if you can see those places down there. But I feel this, these are some of the uh, some really nice places for people to, to live in because you have fresh air, uh, fresh uh, wind, fresh breeze rather. And uh, the toxic in the in the atmosphere is much lesser, which is you know a very big factor in terms of uh, the quality of the oxygen people breathing around here. It's very good. It's really good to, to live in in, in in places like this because everything is natural, hundred percent. And what I just got into my mouth, <laughs> and it tastes a little bit, bit bitter, kind of, kind of tastes bitter, I don't know. Let's see how far we still have to go. I guess we're heading towards that far white house you've seen down there. Uh, Actually. It's a big boat, it's just uh, four passengers here. Just four passengers. And uh, including me also. For the first time, though, it's just a little bit bumpy. But uh, I guess it's because of the wind, the wind of the water. You can see it's a little bit, uh, just a little bit windy, not not that much compared to the ocean. Or maybe it's just why I think because it's my first time on water. Probably it's the way it is the normal thing, I don't know. So, let's see. Like this, but the problem is that you <laughs> you're going to be disconnected disconnected from the whole world. But it's it's actually nice. If you I mean, if you have enough money to stop to stop your your refrigerator, uh, your 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 kitchen and every other thing, if you have enough money to stop your your house with food and everything you need, I think. Living in places like this is amazing. I mean, I, I love to, to, to be here. Because I, I love very calm areas, very very quiet lifestyle. Okay. We are almost there. So we'll probably be turning back here, I don't know yet. So this is the right house. It's on water. That's not where we're heading. We're probably still going. Okay, we're still going forward. Ah. Still heading forward. Further, rather. Still heading further. Honestly, it's not bad for the first time. I'm still gonna try it on a, a paddled, a paddled canoe. In fact, my my next adventure will probably be on the sea, on 
on uh, what's it called? Is it? Yeah, on a wavy ocean. Wow, that's gonna be amazing. Hopefully very soon I'll, I'll try. I'll, I'll try that. I just want to see what it's like to be inside an ocean. But you know, this is a fresh water actually. But to be on a salty, you know how wavy a salty ocean can be. It's like it's very wavy. So I, I want to. Uh, I'll just want, uh, I would like to see what it's like to be on a boat on that kind of water, you know, it's very interesting. Actually, this is better than I, I expected, but not bad. Can I send it? Ah, okay, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, this is getting really fast. <laughs> I didn't expect us to go this far, but you know, nice. Sometimes you just want to do something crazy. <laughs> I guess this is one of those moments. <laughs> wow. Uh, my camera is very close to the water. Wow, this looks good. Okay. Now I'm shooting my own documentary. You know, you know that, that kind of feeling. <laughs> Okay, so well, let's get back before the phone gets wet. Mm -hmm. 
This was the house I showed you earlier. Down there. Oh, sorry, one of the houses I showed you. Not, one, not the house. It's been about 11 minutes since we left. So I guess we'll be back in uh, we'll be back there in about four or five minutes or so.
out to this plant. Yes. Finally, we're back. Oh, it's been fun, man. Okay. Okay, we're back at the resort. Here is another part. Here is another part of it, and it looks really calm and really nice. We're going to see some fishes. I hope uh, they are as big as I'm being told. Oh, okay. It's a pond. Uh, okay. Uh, I, I guess these are crayfish. Okay, they are crayfish, but they are really big. Wow. That's a lot of them, man. Are they, is it crayfish or fish? Oh, hold on. Those are fishes, not crayfish. They're not big. I already said they are big. Oh, you're my I told you. Thank you very much. Goodbye. I, I, I don't know if you can see them well. They're not that big, but there are so many of them there. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's see. So many. Wow. <laughs> I, I don't know if you can see that in the camera, but it's a very good way to save money while raising fish while raising fish he said you know the only thing you probably spend money on is um the cost of setting up the place as you can see they're made from cheap materials you don't have to worry much on uh, buying expensive stuff and one very good factor about this is that you save a lot of money All right, guys, I'm going back. So I really hope you like this video. And if, and if you do, please subscribe to this channel and like this video and share, you know, 
I guess I'll, I'll be coming out with uh, this kind of content. And let me know what you think about this video in the comment section. It's very important. Please, please like and comment. Thank you.